The only way to play this game is the third option, Wooden Water Rage. You have the first option, the street skating session, which is people have compared it to like the poor man's version of Skate or Die. And then you have um, Big Wave Encounter, which is surfing. But you know, do the Wooden Water Rage, and you get both. Now, as for who to choose, I mean, they're both pretty eclectic. The B button has two weird characters, whereas A button has one weird character. So you know me, I'm going to go with the weird. I'm going to go with a Tiki Man, and I forget the other guy's name. You know, it's a cat in a tuxedo. I mean, how can you not love that? So we have Tiki Man here. And, um... I, I like this game, you know. The option, of course, is to rack up points. Right now, I'm making this look easier than it is. Mo no one ever comes off right off the gate and, you know, is good at this game. There is a bit of a learning curve. Now, and um, people will say that it's because the controls are flawed. Maybe they are. <clears throat> but it, it does take a little bit of practice to be able to do anything, basically, without being overly careful. Now, the surfing, that's a whole other thing entirely. I firmly believe that the surfing is basically luck. You know, you get points for doing the jump. Oh man, that was close. Yeah, what you're trying to do is you're trying to get to the pier on the right side, but it randomly appears. Pier, the pier randomly appears. Yeah, something like that. But um, see, it's not showing up. <clears throat> oh, I'm gonna bail. Yep. I love that. Oh, there we go. <clears throat> So the idea is just to rack up points and stay alive. 